Lab Wine Company is working on this technology with Bloomfield Robotics just because of the importance that crop estimation plays in the Washington wine industry. Uh, for wineries getting the crop load to where they want it, to growers being able to get their crop load inside of their contract specifications, and being able to do it as early and accurately as possible. This provides an objective tool to be able to run through the vineyard and get this information. What a technology like Flash allows you to do is, instead of covering 20 plants per 10 acres, if there's 900 plants per acre and we're covering a quarter of it, we're getting to the tune of 225 plants per acre sample size. Now it's not quite the same sample because you're not harvesting the entire vine. You're getting a picture of it and you've got to calculate in how many clusters you're seeing and how many are obscured by leaves, shoots, or other clusters. But the goal is really to tighten the range of the percentage of how close you are to that final crop estimate. Hopefully as Flash is able to run through the same block year over year, it will start to be able to take both the historical information and the historical berry size and equate that down to the actual measurements and see. Bigger growers would probably lease or own their own unit. Um, they would, instead of having a couple of interns counting clusters, counting crop, doing scouting, one could possibly run this unit along with the, some of their other responsibilities. Uh, when you get to the smaller grower size, definitely see an avenue where there's a service provider uh, like Colab Wine Company offering that service to growers to go through and scan the block and uh, allow that output report to be back on the web portal for them.